Do what? Well, there's a pretty good chance on any play there was a flag for him. There's two teams playing aggressive. And so, I mean, you know, I mean, it is what it is. That's football today. I mean, you got two teams out there in each other's face. You know, it's a heavyweight bout. And so, you know, it is what it is. How do you think Clint made the game to overcome that first pick and come back since he got more comfortable? Awesome. I mean, he, you know, that was a tough game. I mean, he... They, they hit the quarterback a lot. I thought our old line did a tremendous job as the game settled in. I mean, they at the end we put them in some some tough situations with going empty protection with max blitz, and the, you know the pros and cons of that. I mean, like the, like the, when we hit Bowie up the seam. I mean, we knew they were going to cover zero. You know, we either gonna get socked there or it's gonna be a big play. And so you, sometimes you just gotta play blackjack every now and again and hope for a, a, you know 21. And so, good play, you know, obviously by Bowie and, and Clint. But I thought he did a great job of settling in. You know, I mean, we go out there, we, we probably have the worst first drive you could possibly have. And then all I told him was, ah, we got that out of our system. Let's, let's try to go make some plays. And then we just drive down and score, and it's 7-7, seven to 0-0. Seven, zero to zero. Let's, let's, it's, you know, let bygones do bygones and, and just keep playing. If you were told before the game that you are going to lose a turnover about 3 to nothing, would you think you have a shot? Nah, I mean, I would say no in every game I've ever coached them, so no. But, you know, I do think that that is a testament to our kids' physical nature. I mean, we, we, we played hard, you know, and then when we put the defense in bad situations, they gave up a field goal twice and then zero points one other time. I mean, good gracious, I mean, you know, that's the difference in the game in my opinion. WVU offense seemed to wear them down in the fourth quarter. Did you have that feeling that, the, that your offense started to wear them down? I thought we ran the ball well in the fourth quarter. You know, I mean, I thought that, especially right there at the end, I mean, basically that they're going to overload the box and we got we got to get the first down. I thought that was awesome. And uh, Wendell did a great job of ball security and, and, and hitting the hole there. But I do think we wore on them. I think, I mean, our old line plays physical, and they play physical every week. So I do think that um, <coughs> I give our old line some props. And I, you know, we lost Russell, and then people just stepped up. And there's no difference on defense. You know, we lost players on both sides. They lost players, and then it's next man up. You know, so. Are you trying to get Brown to play more? Yeah, I mean, well, they did, but they they had a safety trying to help as much as possible. I mean, it's just the nature of their defense is tough. I mean, you, you want safeties involved in the run game, but you also want to try to help out with, with, with seven, so, or with any outside of the <coughs> And so we were trying to exploit that as much as possible. Didn't think we did a very good job at the beginning. We just kept taking shots and kept taking shots. Missed on, and which is typically the case, we're going to miss on a lot of them, but when you do hit, you know, it's typically pretty good. Offense, what, what did you see there? And what did, what did you call? How did that? Well, they were just playing man, and so we basically just ran a little scissor route with them, and, um, and we took them on the run. And so they, it's just a man beat them, you know, really, and so they, they were playing a lot of man on third down. And so they did that leading up to the game, didn't do it a whole lot the first half, and then the second half, you know, really turned their identity. And when they started doing that, then obviously that was something we did. down the field, and uh, there were times where the corners did a good job, their corners did a good job of not letting us get a release, and they got pushed out of bounds one time. And so we, we were trying to get them vertical shots as much as possible. It's ironic that they're underneath that, so they wanted to do that and, and push the house. So, you know, obviously, it's, I mean, we want to balance out those two guys. We feel like both of them are extremely talented. We, we want to balance, balance them out as much as possible, but um, we got to make plays, too. <coughs> Kevin White's ceiling and where he is now, is that closing a little bit? It's a good question. I don't know, man. The kid's special. He's, just a, he's a physical kid. He's playing with a lot of confidence right now. I mean, that catch he made, that one-handed catch he made, was, you know, at that, that time in the game, it's just uh, pretty special. With uh, Clint's decision,